two, one. Hello, <laughs> welcome to the next uh, English, uh, the truest English lesson. And what's the plan for today? <laughs> so for today we have been some revision of Unit uh, 27, new lesson, Unit 28, and some reading. Okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, so let's start. Good morning. Good morning. So we start with revision, Unit 27, detached. Uh -huh. Detach, uh, don't make it no, detached. Detached. Uh, detached. 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 Uh, one moment. Uh, Interest. Detached. Uh, de not attached. No. No, no, no. Detached. <laughs> detached. Uh, Shall we go near terrace? Detach, don't make it... Yes, yes, no, okay, don't make it no rodzinne, detach. Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Semi-detached. Semi-detached bliźniak. Uh, terrest. Terrest, szeregowiec. Mm -hmm. Cottage. Uh, cottage, domek na wsi. Residence. Residence, rezydencja. Mm -hmm. Thatched. Thatched, uh, domek ze strzechy. Mm-hmm. Skyscraper. Skyscraper, uh, drapacz mm -hmm. In which type of house does the family get the most privacy? Uh, the family gets the most privacy in detached. Mm -hmm. In a detached house. Okay. house. Mm -hmm. Why is a terraced house cheaper to build than a semi-detached one? A terrace uh, house is cheaper to build than semi-detached house because they have a lot of common walls <laughs> and common yeah and then the more let's say more houses are built together mm -hmm. uh, when we have semi-detached there is one big building, then another one, then another mm -hmm. one, there's okay. one in a row. So, so it's <laughs> bigger in size. Yeah, bigger mm -hmm. in size. Okay, great. Um, which house will be the most convenient for you? A cottage, a residence or a detached house? Uh, the most convenient would be a cottage. A cottage, okay, mm -hmm. why? And because it's... <laughs> <laughs> because mm -hmm. it's traditional. Okay, because it's traditional, <laughs> okay. How many bedrooms do you think a house needs to be considered a residence? According to the book, uh, six bedrooms a uh, house needs to, needs to have to be mm -hmm. considered as a residence. Yeah, <laughs> so a house needs to have six bedrooms to be considered mm -hmm. a residence. Okay, what's the official residence of the American president. Uh, White House is the official residence of the president. Of the... Of, of the president of the United States. Mm -hmm, okay. Yes. <laughs> What's the roof of a thatched cottage covered with? A thatched cottage is covered with okay. straw. Mm -hmm. Very good. Which two famous skyscrapers were destroyed in the terrorist attack on the 11th of September in 2001? Mm -hmm. Mm, uh, twin towers were destroyed uh, at the uh, at the ter ter terrorist attack in the terrorist, in the ter terrorist attack uh, on eleven uh, on the eleventh of September. Mm -hmm. Very good. Adjust. Adjust. Uh, adjust. Dostosować, uh, regulować. Adjustable. Adjustable, regulowane. Adapt. Adapt, to stosować. Okay, so adjust and adapt are similar uh. in meaning. However, we usually use adjust when we think of temporary change and adapt when we mean a more permanent one. Mm -hmm. What do your eyes do when you open them at night in a dark bedroom? If I open my eyes in dark bedroom, my eyes needs to adjust to the darkness. <laughs> Very good. Have human beings adapted well to living in almost any, cond any conditions? Yes, human uh, beings uh, have, adapt. have adapted to live in almost every condi any, condition. any conditions. Very good. When driving a car, why do you have to adjust your radio from time to time? 
uh, while riding a car, I have to adjust my radio from time to time because it loses signal. Signal, okay. Mm -hmm. Very good. So you have to pick it up again. Mm -hmm. Is the height of a bicycle seat adjustable? Yes, the height of a bicycle seat is adjustable. What things are adjustable in a car? Uh, mirrors, uh, seats and seat belts are adjustable in the car. Why do so many drivers adapt their cars nowadays to take gas instead of diesel or petrol? Uh, some drivers adjust their cars, adapt, adapt, adapt their cars to run on gas instead of diesel or petrol because it's cheaper. Very mm -hmm. good. What do children have to adapt to when they move to a different town? When children have to move to a different town, they have to they have to, to adapt that. to new neighbors, friends. Yeah, yeah new friends, new and neighbors. And environment. Mm -hmm. Very good. When is it extremely hard to adjust to living alone? It's extremely hard to adjust to, to living alone because you know when when we have lived with someone with someone else yeah, before <laughs> now we the person oh, is alone yeah, here they say about when we lived with someone before yes. yeah or here they say when you've been married and then your husband or wife dies something mm -hmm. like that mm -hmm. accordingly. According, accordingly, this is called Bind, uh -huh. bind, bound, bound. Bind, bound, bound, uh, piąsać. Bind somebody to do something. Bind somebody to do something, czyli nakłonić kogoś do zrobienia czegoś. Okay, unite. Unite, jednoczyć. Uh, censor. Censor, cenzura. It's bound to ah, happen. Two two sense, uh, mm -hmm. It's bound to happen. It's bound to happen. Na pewno się wydarzy. Okay. So, if the price of grain grew by ten percent, would you expect the price of flour to rise accordingly? Yes, if the price <laughs> of grain grew uh, about ten percent. The price I would expect, expect that price of flour to rise to rise Accord accordingly. Very good. <laughs> if you manage the company and your competition introduced a new product to the market, would you act accordingly? Yeah. If you managed, if, yeah. uh, if you manage the company and your competition introduced a new product on the market, would you act accordingly? Yes, if I manage a company and uh, competition. competition launch the new product on the market, I would act accordingly. Very good. But, but I studied it at home. There are so, ma so many better examples to use accordingly, like accordingly to the law, accordingly to the situation. No, according to the law. Because like, you see like the way you answered the other question, when you told me accord, uh, according to the book, exactly, that's how you say it, according to the book, yeah, uh, a residence needs to have six, like a house needs to have six bedrooms to be considered a residence. You can't say accordingly to the book. No. It's an adverb. No, it's an adverb, exactly. It's an, accordingly is an adverb, so you can't use it like that. You have to use it as an object to something as a consequence of that thing this thing happens it's like accordingly if this happens then this will happen it's a consequence to something so it can't be used like that according it's much more if you want to say according to the law uh, you can say accordingly to the law it means the law happened for you to do that and it's not that so the law oppress you to do this so according to the law mm -hmm. okay, okay yeah so why do bank robbers sometimes bind up security guards when breaking into a bank? A security guards bank. Bank robbers. 
Uh, bank. Why do bank robbers uh, sometimes buy up security guards when breaking into a bank? Uh, security uh, oh. bank robbers bind up, up uh, <laughs> uh, security guards to so they don't Stop. interrupt them exactly. to rob the bank. <laughs> <laughs> what kind of things bind people together? Uh, yeah, um, <laughs> a common interest. Common, common interest. Okay. Mm -hmm. Yes, the same. Uh, common interest to bind people uh, together. Are you bound by an agreement after you've signed it? Yes, I'm bound to an agreement. By. I buy. Yeah, I'm bound by. I ah, okay. Mm -hmm. I'm bound by. An agreement an argument after signing it. Okay, when are you bound to pay the rent for your house? I'm bound to pay the rent for my house after signing the contract. No, like at which period of the time? Uh, like when, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> yeah. At the end of the month, the beginning of each month? Yes, I'm bound to pay the rent for my about house uh, at the end or the, the beginning of the month. Okay, great. What are you bound by law to do when you are a witness to a road accident? What are you bound to do by the law when you are a witness to a road accident? I'm bound to call by law, by law to call the police and help the Victims. victims when when I see an accident a road accident when you're witness to a road accident okay very good what's bound to happen if you come to a curve in the road and you don't adjust your speed accordingly what's bound to happen if you come to a curve on the road and you don't adjust your speed accordingly if I come again to a curve to a curve of a road and i don't adjust the speed accordingly, accordingly i'm bound i'm bound to, to yes. have an accident okay yes, yes, yes. <laughs> do you know anyone who can combine being charming with being determined no i don't know anyone who is who can combine? Who can combine being charmed and charming, charming and determined at once? Okay. For what reasons can people sometimes unite in opposition to their government? People can unite to the opposition of the government. In opposition. In opposition to the government if they, they want, if they don't want to have. I want you to use censor. <laughs> yeah, ah, okay, yes, censor, censor, it's about censor. If the government wants to censor everything in the internet, yes? Or to pass a law. <laughs> and if the government wants to pass the law to censor the internet. Okay. Yes? <laughs> Very good. Flow? A flow przepływ. Cash flow? Cash flow przepływ gotówki. Roadworks. Wow, roadworks. Pracę drugą. Mm -hmm. Roboty drugą. Okay, which sea does the Nile flow into? Which sea does the Nile flow into? Uh, Nile flows into the Mediterranean Sea. Okay, what's likely to happen if we don't bind up a deep cut and we let the blood flow from the wound? What's likely to happen if we don't bind up a dip cut and we let the brush roll from it? If I don't bind up a dip cut, a dip cut and let, let blood to let blood flow from the wound. Uh, okay, flow from the wound. Uh, you likely to bleed to death. I likely to. Okay. <laughs> Lead to the okay. What can interrupt the flow of traffic in the city? Uh, too many cars may block the 
flow of traffic in the city. So many groups of the human traffic, okay. Uh -huh. Too many cars. Uh -huh. And what else? What did we see? Uh, <laughs> uh, too many. And, uh, road? Uh, okay, yes, yes. Uh, road uh, works mm -hmm. can block the flow. Can interrupt. Can interrupt the flow of traffic, traffic in the city. Mm -hmm. Very good. Does the internet enable a free flow of information? No, internet doesn't uh, block. Does the internet enable a free flow of information? Uh, yes, the internet enables the free flow of information. Okay, why is it so important for a company to maintain a good cash flow? It's important for the company to maintain the a good cash flow. A good cash flow because it's important for running a company. Mm -hmm. <laughs> dance. Uh, dance against. Dancely. Densely against. Tom. Populated. Populated. Uh, zaludniony. Urban. Urban miejski. Mm -hmm. Rural. Is water denser than air? Yes, water is denser than air. What do drivers switch on in dense warp to be visible? Uh, drivers drivers switch on dense fog lights. Fog lights, oh. okay. Fog lights to be visible in dense, dense fog. In dense fog. In dense fog. In dense fog. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Are rural areas more densely populated than urban ones? In no, rural uh, areas, areas aren't and densely, more. more densely populated mm -hmm. than urban ones. Very good. Why are urban areas more damaging to the environment than rural ones? Uh, urban areas? Mm -hmm. are more damaging for the environment than rural ones because <laughs> they produce they produce more waste mm -hmm. <laughs> how can urban life affect our health urban life can affect our health by causing cancer mm -hmm. <laughs> stress related stress related illnesses okay mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. or pollution too Pollution. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because there's more way, more pollution in urban areas, so you can have some illness caused by pollution. Yeah, respiratory issues usually. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. How does the urban environment of Rome differ from that of New York? How does the urban environment of Rome differ from that of New York? The urban environment of Rome is more differs from differs from. That of New York. That in New York. That because because <laughs> it's more I don't know. It's more rural than modern New York. <laughs> we just it can't be rural if we just say it's an urban environment. <laughs> but it's yeah more than New York. <laughs> no, it's the structure we talked about it last time. Okay, so. Um, the architectural structure, how is it? Architectural structure is... Of which one? Which one are you talking about? Of Rome? It's uh, of Rome is... More ancient. More ancient. Okay. And yes. then New York has more modern buildings. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. Which is normal. It's the whole of Europe is like that. More big cities. France, Paris, Rome. Even Warsaw, like it's more ancient architecture, European architecture, and others it's more modern, glassy, you know, modern buildings. Okay, so uh, it's your turn to ask me questions. Populated. Uh, populated uh, is also densely populated. Yeah, I think Warsaw is densely populated. Uh, bound to happen. Mm -hmm. uh, 
Yes, we can't. <laughs> so how to use the question is it's It's bound to happen that we will have a lesson next week? No. No? Mm, that's my question. <laughs> I also checked this, but it's bound to happen. It's also it means if you do this, what's bound to happen? If you don't come to work, what's bound to happen? If you don't turn off your speed when you meet a curve in the load, what's bound to happen? Like, what's the consequence if you do something, basically? If this, you do this and this, what's going to be the consequence? Like, whatever, it's bound to happen. <laughs> okay, but do you feel, okay, okay, and... Uh, and it's bound to happen that you lose your job when you don't come to work okay yeah something like okay is it, uh, what's bound to ask what's bound to happen if you don't come to work for example okay this is like, okay uh, what's bound to happen if you don't come to work well it's likely bound to happen i'm likely bound to lose my job if i don't come to work Okay. Okay. Uh, flow. Uh, yes. Uh, what? Uh, what uh, does the fistula flow into? Mm -hmm. Which one? I don't know. I don't know the sea which the vistula flows in. No, okay. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a Baltic sea. Okay, Baltic sea. Mm -hmm. So adjust. Adjust. Uh, okay, one moment. Uh, uh, okay, it's, is it important to adjust the height of? of C of a bicycle seat when you want to go for a, a ride. It's Is it important to adjust? Adjust the height of seat if you want to go yeah. on a, <laughs> on no, a no, no. ride. No, I wouldn't say it. I wouldn't ask such a question, but okay. Yeah, it's important to adjust. And let, if it's necessary, of course, because you can just adjust the seat if, depending on your height and everything, if it's necessary, it's important to adjust, you, you know, the seat of a bicycle if you're going for a ride. So detached. Detached. Uh, do you live in Bitkush in, uh, in detached? In a detached house. In a detached house. But you can say that detached because detached can all, it's a verb, so it can also be a verb. You have to say detached house. But do you use it here as a verb? No, no. no. They can never ask you, like, in any question here, they always say house. Which house? house? Yes. Detached house. So they also. Because it's like, a, these are like adjectives to define that, mm. like, they're adjectives to the house. Skyscraper, that is understandable. We already know it's a house. And cottage, we already know it's a house. Mm -hmm. but, and residence, we also already know. Mm -hmm. Attached. Mm -hmm. uh, terrace, I mean, attached and so detached. We have put, to say they house. should put it here, house, yeah, house, yeah, house. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Because I can't say, oh, yeah. I live in a detached yeah, mm -hmm. house. Now, now I realize it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. <laughs> you see. That, yeah, it's like. Yeah. Be but a cottage, we all know it's a house because it's yeah. one word that defines the whole house. A residence, you know, it's a house. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. A skyscraper, we also know that. But detached, semi-detached, you could make a mistake. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So do you live in Bitbush in a detached house? 
Oh no, I don't mm -hmm. live in a detached house in Bedgosh. Um, adapt. Adapt, 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 adapt. Uh, okay, one moment. Adapt. And uh, how long does it take to adapt to living in Poland? In your uh, opinion. How long does it take? It depends on a person. It depends on a person on how long it takes to adapt to to be kosher in any other new city. I guess it depends on a person. If you already know people, yeah. But usually. A year is enough for you to adapt. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So, new lesson. So you you look when you get home. You look through this vocabulary. We we'll do the next class. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Half of them here, and then the other. Um, so lean, lean, lean. Lean, uh, lean, leaned, lent, leaning, lean on, angle. So lean, leaning, lean on, angle. Uh huh. So lean, uh, leaned, leaned, lean, lent. Lean, uh, lent, No, lean, leaned, lent. Uh, leaned, uh, lean, lent. No, lean, leaned. Lint. Lent. Lent. Very good. Uh -huh. So lean. Uh, lean operat się. Uh -huh. Leaning. Leaning um, opierający się. Uh -huh. Pod pochylony. Leaning pochylony. Okay. okay. Lean on. Lean on. Lean on. Uh -huh. Lean on. To lean on. To lean on. Uh, Mm, uh, it's so easy, but now it's so hard. Uh, Mieć oparcie. Lean on. Okay, mm -hmm. to lean on. Okay. To lean on. Okay, to lean on. So angle. Angle uh, count. Okay, in there. Uh -huh. So only in English. Lean. A lean. Leaning. Leaning. Lean on. Lean on. Angle. Angle. A passenger is allowed to lean out of a window on a train. A passenger is allowed to lean out of a window on a train. No passengers aren't allowed to lean on the window. On out, in, of the, uh, out of the window. Uh, lean, uh, lean out of the window. Yes, on a train. Uh, on a train. Mm -hmm. Lean out of. of. Mm -hmm. Put your head out. Mm -hmm. What do you need to do with a, a rudder before you can climb it? What do you need to do with a rudder before you can climb it? What do you need to do with a ladder before you can climb it? Uh, okay, uh, before I can climb the ladder, I need to lean it Again. against the wall. Very good. <laughs> who, who can you lean on in case you need help? Who can you lean on in case you need help? I can lean on my family if I need help. Okay, do you know what angle the leaning tower of Pisa leans at? Do you know what angle the leaning tower of Pisa leans at? The leaning... The, the leaning... Do you know? Yes, you can say okay, yes. Okay, yes, I know the leaning angle of the leaning tower of Pizza is four percent. Four? Four percent? No, four degrees. Four deg uh, degrees, yes. Yeah, yes. four degrees. Oh, because okay. angle is measured in degrees. What's a right angle? A right angle is 90... Mm, is an angle? Is an angle of 90 degrees. Very good. Very good. Cause. Cause. Swear. Oath. Cause, swear, swore, sworn, oath. Cause, if they repeat uh, our meaning in, uh, uh, in English. Uh -huh. Cause, mm -hmm. swear, swear, swore, swore, sworn, sworn, oath. 
Uh, oath. Mm -hmm. Oath. Uh, oath. Mm -hmm. Swear, swore, sworn. Swear, swore, sworn. Mm -hmm. Curse. Curse. Okay, curse. You can translate. Uh, two curse, yes. Mm -hmm. curse. Pleasure. Two, two, two curse. You can do both. To curse and curse. Okay. To uh, przeklinać. Mm -hmm. Very good. Um, oh, back to. Uh, swear. Uh, swear, przysięgać. Mm -hmm. I przysięgać, swear. Uh -huh. Very good, very przeklinać good. Też. <laughs> oath. Oath, przysięga. Mm -hmm. So when you swear an oath in court, you promise to tell the truth. When you say I could have sworn, you mean that you are almost certain. If I say I could have sworn, I saw him yesterday at the bank. So it means I'm almost certain that I saw the person. And if I swear an oath in court, of course it means I'm going to have to tell the truth. Yeah. Great. So you understand mm -hmm. on the same page. Are the words curse and swear similar in meaning? Yeah. Are the words curse and swear similar in meaning? Yes, the words curse and sworn. Swore, swear. swear are similar to the in meaning. Okay. What do some uh, What do some of us do when we hit our forehead in a on a cupboard drawer? What do some of us do when we hit our head on a cupboard drawer? Uh, when we hit our forehead against the cardboard drawer, we curse. Yeah, we sometimes yeah. curse. <laughs> what do animals do you think are a real curse? What animals do you think are a real curse? Uh, rats and insects are question. the real curse. I don't agree with this question, but either way, how do you say animals are cursed? <laughs> yeah, Have you ever cursed <laughs> yourself for not buying something which was a real beginning? Have you ever cursed yourself for not buying something which was a real bargain? Uh, let's say, no, not really, but okay, I yes. have ever cursed. Yes, I have cursed. Yes, I have cursed myself. myself for not buying something that was a real bargain. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it happens. But not really, I don't know. Why shouldn't, <laughs> why shouldn't we swear in front of children? Why shouldn't we swear in front of children? Uh, we shouldn't swear in front of children because they learn from us to swear them. Yeah, because they, yeah, they learn from us. Yeah. So what you do, they will imitate at some point. What do people swear when they are getting married? What do people swear? when they're getting married uh, people swear to live together forever when they are getting when i getting married mm -hmm, very good are witnesses in court required to swear an oath are witnesses in court required to swear an oath yes witnesses in court of law uh, are required are required to uh, swear and oath. Very good. Give me an example of a sentence beginning with I could have sworn. I uh, okay, give me uh, an I example could, of a sentence. Or? I could have sworn I saw you yesterday in the supermarket. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> okay, great. Uh, in the Middle Ages did people believe that certain places were cursed in the Middle Ages? Did people believe that certain places were cursed? Yes, in the Middle Ages, people believed that certain places are cursed. Well, were cursed. Were cursed. Oh, ah, yeah, mm -hmm. they were cursed. Very good, very good. So we end here for today. Oh, you can ask me a question with curse. Curse. Uh, do you curse when you hit the cardboard? No, cardboard. <laughs> when I hit my head. When you hit your head against the cardboard. 
Sometimes I swear when I hit my head against the cowboy. <laughs> Lean on. Lean on. Uh, are there people in Poland that you can lean on? Are there people in Poland? Poland that which which you can lean on. That you can lean on. That that you can lean on. Yeah, because people you can never just switch. Mm, yes, the who people. Who and who you can lean on? Yeah, yeah. Even that is both things and people. Are, yes, the people in Poland who I can lean on. Mm -hmm. uh, so it's twenty leading. Go to twenty two. Twenty yes. No, twenty two. Mm, uh, be swell, swell, swollen, swelling, stink, stunk, stunk, sting. Uh, we do. Uh, why do we say that bees stink and mosquitoes bite? We say that the bees stink and mosquitoes bite because bees have stings and mosquitoes don't. What <coughs> are the things we like? and this like about the bees, we like the fact that the bees produce honey and we don't like when they stink us. Uh, when can it be extremely dangerous to be stung by a bee? It can be extremely dangerous to be stung by a bee if you are allergic to bee stings or it stings you on your tongue. Why? Because if you are allergic to the stings, sting swells very much and it causes a lot of pain. If you wanted to reduce the swelling, would it be a good idea to use ice or a cold compress? Yes, if, uh, if you wanted to reduce the swelling, it would be a good idea to use ice or a cold compress. And must you remove the sting before putting on a compress? Yes, you must remove the sting before putting on a compress. Uh, if you lower the cost of production, would your profits swell? Yes, if I lower the cost of production, your profits could swell. What can cause the swelling of an eye? A sting or a punch can cause the swelling of an eye. A uh, stink, stunk, stunk. Infamous. What vegetable is infamous for making people eyes? Uh, stink when they peel it. The onion is infamous for making uh, most people's eyes stink when they peel it. Do you easily bear the stinking feeling of iodine on a scratch? Yes, I easily bear the stinging feeling of iodine on a scratch. Have you ever been stung by someone's criticism or remarks? Yes, I've been stung by someone's criticism or remarks. What did that person say? She was very critical about my work and said it was fit for nothing. I was fit, I was fit for nothing. Uh, can harsh words sometimes sting us into action? Yes, harsh words can sometimes sting us into action. Do you know any Italian food producers who are infamous for very poor quality of their products? Yes, I know some Italian food producers who are infamous for very poor quality of their products. Chest, cupboard, a stethoscope. Uh, how does a doctor check the lungs? A doctor checks the lungs by putting a stethoscope to the chest and listening uh, to how we breathe. What can chest pains be a sign of? Chest pains can be a sign of a heart attack. What kind of things did they keep in a chest in the past? They kept tre treasure and jewelry in a chest in the past. What do we store in a cupboard? We store dishes, bowls, saucers and food in a cupboard. Sweep, swept, swept. Uh, sweep under the carpet. How do they usually sweep that leaves in autumn? They usually sweep that leaves in autumn into heaps in uh, autumn. Hmm. Who's responsible for sweeping the snow off the pavement in front of the building? 
The owner is usually responsible for sweeping the snow off the pavement in front of the uh, building. What things do people sometimes sweep under the carpet? People sometimes sweep things they've done wrong or something embarrassing under the carpet. Which part of the world is very often swept by heavy rains and thunder thunderstorms? South Asians very often swept by heavy rains and thunderstorms. Have you ever been swept up by the crowd during the sales? Yes, I've been swept up by the crowd during the uh, sales. What happened? It was during the last sales in the uh, Euro market in Main Street. I was standing in the queue waiting for the opening. Suddenly the crowd rushed to the door, sweeping me up on its way. It, I was lucky not to get hurt. A weave, a wave, waven, web, weave, webbed, webbed, whipping, wi whipping willow, wicker. Uh, what are some baskets woven from? Some baskets are woven from strips of wicker. What does a weeping willow look like and where does it usually grow? A weeping willow has long thin branches hanging downwards and it usually grows near water. Uh, why do spiders wave web, weave webs? Uh, spiders weave webs to catch insects they eat. Are there any film directors that you particularly like for weaving complicated plots? Yes, there are some film directors that are Particularly, particularly like for weaving complicated plots. Give me an example, for example, M. Night Shyamalan. Uh, do you find that in some films the plot seems to weave forever? Yes, I found that in I some... Find I found that in some films the plot seems to weave forever. Did people weave with joy when World War II was over. Yes, people wept with joy when World War was over. Knit, 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 knitted, knit or knitted. What do you usually knit from wool? Do you usually knit gloves, sweaters or socks from wool? Have you ever had a hand knitted sweater? Yes, I've had a hand knitted sweater. Is knitting still as popular as it was a hundred years ago? No, knitting isn't as popular as it was a hundred years ago anymore. What happens if broken bones don't knit properly? If broken bones don't knit properly, they need to be broken and put together again. Are there any ideas or beliefs that knit together all the natives of your country, no matter where they live? Yes, there are some ideas and beliefs that knit together all the natives of my country, no matter what they live. Give me an example, for example, football. Bow, bow tie, knot, tie the knot, knot. Uh, how does a bow tie differ from a tie? A bow tie is knotted in a bow and doesn't hang down. Are bow ties more common than ties? No, bow ties aren't more common than ties. How many knots do you tie when you knot a tie? You tie only one knot when you knot a tie. Uh, how can women tie their hair? hair? Women can tie their hair in knots or with bows. What's the best age for a person to tie the knot? Now, I think the best age for a person to tie the knot is 25. Okay, very good. At which time did you tie the knot? When? Uh, when I tied the knot when I was 32. Mm -hmm. Okay. Four, I don't know. Mm -hmm. You tied the knot when you were early. Okay. Do, which one do you prefer, a bow tie or a tie? I prefer recently bow tie. Okay, bow tie. Very good. Um, do you like 
knitted, hand knitted sweaters? Do you like knit? Do you like hand knitted yeah. sweaters? Yes, I like hand knitted uh, sweaters. Okay, do you have one? Uh, yes, maybe mm -hmm. it's theoretically mm -hmm. hand knitted. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Very good. Um, have you ever broken your bones that you needed them to be knitted back together? Uh, no, I've never mm -hmm. uh, broke okay. my bone that had to be knitted together. Okay. Mm -hmm. Broke again. Mm -hmm. <laughs> okay. Uh, so, why do spiders weave webs? Spiders weave webs in order to catch a fly there or other insects. Do you remember the last time you whipped with joy? No, I don't remember when I whipped the last time, the last time uh, whipped with joy. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. uh, what things pe do people usually sweep under the carpet? Uh, people sweep under the carpet unpleasant, embarrassing information about themselves. <laughs> okay. <laughs> do you have any chests at home? Uh, yes, I have a big chest for <laughs> For jewelry and <laughs> and and, and uh, as a treasure. Mm, okay, very <laughs> nice. What do we keep in our cupboards here? Hey, in cupboards, are mm -hmm. we in the cupboards here mm -hmm. next door? We keep cups, mm -hmm. bowls. And this, I think, okay. and this is it. That's enough. Okay, great. Have you ever been stung by a bee? Um, yes, I've ever been stung by a bee. Mm -hmm. How did it feel? Uh, I think at that time I didn't know it was a bee. Oh, okay, <laughs> great. Mm -hmm. Because it was in the grass and then I stung. Have you ever it. woken up? with swollen eyes? No, I think... Okay. No, I never woken up with swollen eyes. Okay. Mm -hmm. mm, so... Okay, one last question. Mm -hmm. Okay... Uh, so what vegetable isn't famous for stinging people's eyes when they peel it? Uh, yeah, the onion is unfamous for stinging human eyes by peeling. When they peel it. When they peel it. Okay, unit 23. You can do unit 23, we still have some time. The reading? Mm -hmm. Yes. <laughs> Yes, it's uh, it's in front, right before the, the exercise, exactly. Uh, shoelace, undo, undo, undo. What things do we usually tie in a bow? We usually tie shoelaces in a bow. Okay. At what age do children start to tie their shoelaces? Children start to tie their shoelaces when they are three years old. Do you lose your temper if you can't undo a knot in your shoelaces? Yes, I sometimes lose my temper if I can't undo a knot in my shoelaces. Uh, what may happen if you walk in shoes with the laces undone? If I walk in shoes with uh, the laces undone, you may step on them and fall down. Muddy, slippery, slip. Be on a slippery slope. What are you likely to do when you're sliding down a muddy slope? You are likely to slip when you're 
sliding down a muddy slope. Have you ever slipped on a banana skin? Yes, I've slipped on a banana skin. Do you slip your shoes off quickly? Uh, or do you undo the shoelaces carefully? I slip my shoes off quickly. Uh, when can a pavement be slippery? A pavement can be slipper, slippery when it's wet or covered with ice. At what age do most teenagers start to slip out of their parents' control? Most teenagers start to slip out of their parents' control when they're 18. Uh, why is it difficult to catch fish with one's hands? It's difficult to catch fish with one's hands because they're slippery and easy slip out of hands. Are you on the slippery slope to become an addict when you start taking drugs? Yes, you're on a slippery slope to become an addict when you start taking drugs. What do parents or the children to do when their shoes are muddy? Parents or the children to wipe their shoes on the mat or slip them off outside when their shoes are muddy. Yield, despair, be the despair of somebody. What do people do when they yield to despair? People sometimes commit suicide or drink heavily when they yield to despair. What can drive people to despair? Health problems, lack of money, and uh, can drive people to despair. Would you be close to despair if you were unemployed for a year? Yes, I'd be close to despair if I were unemployed for a year. And when can parents despair of finding their child alive? Parents can despair of finding their child alive when their child is being kidnapped. Would most people despair and yield to all demands if their child were kidnapped? Yes, most people would despair and yield to all demands if their child were kidnapped. Uh, was there a student in your school who was the despair of the teachers? Yes, there was a student in my school who was the despair of the teachers. Why? Because it, his handwriting was terrible diminish, reduce. Do parents usually diminish their children's achievements? No, parents don't usually diminish their children's achievements. Are certain natural resources diminishing rapidly? Yes, certain natural resources are dimin diminishing rapidly. If you give up smoking, will you reduce the risk of lung cancer or heart attack? Yes, if you give up smoking, you'll reduce the risk of lung cancer or heart attack. Do you have to reduce your speed when you arrive in a town? Yes, you have to reduce your speed when you arrive in a town. When do clothes shops usually reduce the prices? Clothes shops usually reduce their prices during the sales when they want to get rid of their clothes which are out of season. Exaggerate exaggeration. Why do people sometimes exaggerate their illnesses? People sometimes exaggerate their illnesses to get someone's sympathy. Do TV commercials exaggerate the advantages of certain products? Yes, TV commercials exaggerate the advantages of certain products. Can we say without exaggeration that Microsoft is the largest software company in the world? Yes. We can say without exaggeration that Microsoft is the largest software company in the world. Do you usually exaggerate or diminish your achievements? I usually exaggerate my achievements. What do the media sometimes exaggerate? The media sometimes exaggerate the uh, damage caused by uh, this uh, disaster, the number of people killed or injured. Would it be a great exaggeration if you said you knew someone well if you had only met the person once in your life yes i would be a great it would be great exaggeration if you said you knew someone well if you had only met the person once in your life a twist twist of cap ankle sprained do wires often get twisted yes wires often get twisted what do you have to do with the cap of a bottle to open it if you have to twist the cap of a bottle to open it you have to twist the cap off and what can you do if you can't twist the lid of 
a jaw. If you can't twist the lid of a jaw, you can lift it with a knife. How do children usually twist uh, ankles? Children usually twist their ankles by running and jumping too quickly. Does a sprained ankle hurt a lot? Yes, a sprained ankle hurts a lot. Do you like sudden twist of the plot in terms of uh, books? Yes, it. Uh, yes, I like sudden twist of the plot in terms of books. Do newspapers sometimes twist facts about famous film stars? Yes, newspapers sometimes twist facts about famous film stars. Bruise, nasty. Can a person easily get nasty bruises if he's inexperienced and goes snowboarding in high mountains? Yes, a person can easily get nasty bruises if he's inexperienced and goes snowboarding in high mountains. What else can be the cause of a nasty bruise? A punch or falling off a bike can be the cause of a nasty bruise. What do you do with bruised fruit? I cut out the bruised part or and eat the rest. Do you believe that some dogs may turn nasty for no particular reason? Yes, I believe that some dogs may turn nasty for no particular reason. Are elderly brothers sometimes very nasty to the younger sisters? Yes, elder brothers are sometimes very nasty to the younger sisters. What would you do if you had to take medicine which you knew tested nasty but worked? If I had to take medicine which I knew tasted nasty but worked, I tried to swallow it as quickly as possible. Is it a nasty feeling to find out that we've been cheated? Yes, it's a nasty feeling to find out that we've been cheated. Okay, very good. So, some questions. Uh, what do you do with bruised fruits? Uh, with bruised fruits, I cut out the nasty part and eat the rest. Okay. Okay, what can cause a nasty bruise? Uh, a punch on the face can cause a nasty bruise. Or, or falling down off the bike. From mm -hmm. off the bike, okay. Yeah, even a car accident. <laughs> mm -hmm. So do you wires often get twisted? Do wires often get twisted? Uh, yes, wires I think always get twisted. Mm -hmm. Very good. So how do you open uh, a bottle? How do you get rid of the cup of the bottle when you're opening it? Uh, I twist it? No. Yes. Yes, uh, mm -hmm. some bottles I, uh, to open a bottle, mm -hmm. I twist the lid, mm -hmm. cup, cup, the cup. Mm -hmm. the cup, or I lift it. Okay. Lift it up. Okay, very good, I see. Um, okay, uh, what, do the media, uh, what does the media sometimes exaggerate? Uh, media exaggerate the number of people. Mm. <laughs> the number of number of people what? Uh, number of people taking taking part in something, not taking part in something, mm -hmm. <laughs> coming or not coming, <laughs> not coming, and all possible numbers mm -hmm. <laughs> and informations. Mm -hmm. And okay. <laughs> okay, all of that. Okay, so do TV commercials exaggerate the advantage of certain products? Yes, usually TV com commercials exaggerate the uh, and advantages of certain products. Okay, so are natural resources diminishing rapidly? Uh, yes, the natural resources diminishing rapidly. What should you do to reduce the risk of lung cancer? To reduce the um, risk yeah. of lung cancer I should avoid avoid, so. avoid smoking. Uh, 
by uh, uh, air purifier. <laughs> okay. Um, what can drive people to despair? He losing a job for a year, losing a partner, drive people, uh, drive people to this to no. Okay, can you ask me again? Mm -hmm. <laughs> can you ask me again? What drives is? Yeah, people to despair. To despair. Uh, losing a partner, losing a job, drive people to despair. Okay, so if they can, if someone close to you was kidnapped, would you yield to mm -hmm. all the kidnappers' demands? Yes, if someone kidnapped. Kidnapped. Mm -hmm. <laughs> uh, my children, I would yield the kidnappers all demands. I yield to. I yield to all demands of kidnappers. The kidnappers, okay. Um, okay, very good, very good. Um, how do you tie your? Uh, okay, how do you tie your shoelace? In which form? Ah uh, yes, I. Tie shoelaces in a bow. Okay. Yes. Very good. Mm -hmm. um, can your children undo their shoelaces along themselves? Uh, usually they can undo the shoelaces alone. Okay. Usually very good. Excellent. Yes. So tell me five or five words you remember from today's lesson. Uh -huh. uh, one more thing. Today's lesson it was about lean. Mm -hmm. Lean, lean on. Uh, mm -hmm. and, uh, lean, lean on. And curves. Mm -hmm. and, yeah, yeah, curves and was curves were. Mm -hmm. Swear and then? Swear. Uh, oath. Mm -hmm. <laughs> oath. <laughs> okay. Yes, and mm -hmm. something else. A detached house. A detached house, yes. Mm -hmm. Detached house. Okay. Semi detached house. <laughs> Very good, excellent. Thank you. Okay, thank you. And bye. Bye.